In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the camera and document scan options in Notability. You're going to tap on the plus sign in the top right hand corner. This brings you to your media options. If you pick camera, it may ask you um, to give access to the camera, so go ahead and tap OK. And then your camera will open and you can take photos say use photo and it automatically drops that in there. I can also take a picture of a document. So plus camera, take that document picture. And then if I'm ready to use it or I can tap use photo. If I want to retake, I can tap retake. I'm gonna tap use photo. It drops it in there. Then I do have the ability that I can rotate that image if needed. Notice, however, with the camera option, if there are any shadows, glares, anything else going on, those do appear in the picture. Now, since this is just a picture, I can edit it just like I would any other image that I'm adding from my camera roll. One of the other options that they give you in Notability is the ability to use the document scan. So I'm gonna tap on the plus sign and I'm gonna choose document scan. Here, it's going to ask you to position that document in the frame and notice that it will start to try to find where that page is and as soon as it finds it it goes ahead and scans it in there is page two and you can go ahead and choose manual as well and then you would position it and you would click the uh, white circle button to uh, commit that um, picture and I can tap on one of the options to view it. I can crop, change the settings. I can delete or retake. Since page two is in there, page one is in there twice, I'm gonna hit the delete button in the top right hand corner. And then I'm gonna tap done for my editing and I'm gonna tap save. It's gonna ask me, do I wanna insert this in as a PDF or as images? I'm gonna choose images. And so now these are two pictures, again, that I can edit and place into my document. Notice the coloring of those, um, the difference between the color whenever I use the document scan versus an actual photo. The shadowing still happens, so you just may wanna watch where you're um, holding your document. Let me show you what it looks like to do a PDF. So I'm gonna document scan again just do one page I'm gonna choose save in the bottom right hand corner this time I'm gonna say PDF and you'll notice that it will go to page two and it inserts that document notice that um, it is uh, I can't rotate it now that it's in that PDF mode so just make sure when you are taking the picture um, your camera adjusts itself. Let me show you that again. So if I rotate around, see now the um, camera options are on the right instead of at the bottom. So now this is gonna be taking a picture in um, portrait mode for me. So then I'm gonna tap save. I'm gonna insert a PDF this time. And so now on the next page, there is my PDF. And then I can now annotate that picture just like I normally would annotate a PDF that I bring into Notability. I can still do it here. And then the difference with the images is that those images can then now be moved. I can still write on them and the writing will go with those graphics. So it just depends on how um, you want to import those um, scanned or pictures that you take yourself from your iPad into Notability.